What's up YouTube, Chris here with Trust 360 bringing you guys an awesome Minecraft tutorial. So in this tutorial I'll be teaching you guys how to get the new Too Many Items inventory modification on the full version, version 1.0.0. So uh, this is a very easy tutorial, much like the previous versions for beta on how to install this if you have used Too Many Items before. But for those of you who haven't, I'm just going to go ahead and upload and show you guys how to do it. So first off, what you're going to need is you're going to need to download WinRAR and the Too Many Items inventory mod out of the description. So once you have WinRAR downloaded and installed, go ahead and download Too Many Items and then you'll be ready to go with this tutorial. So what you're going to do, once you download Too Many Items and you have WinRAR, you should see a, a icon on your desktop that looks like this if this is where you downloaded it to. It should say Too Many Items 2011 11 19 which was the release 11.19.2011 when this was released. So once you have that and you have WinRAR installed, just right click and click Extract to Too Many Items 2011 underscore 11 underscore 19. What this is going to do is going to create a folder over here with all the modded class files in them. So once you have all that extracted, what you can do now is you can go down to your Start button, type in percent app data percent. What this is going to do is going to open up your roaming folder once you click enter and you should see a folder here called period minecraft. So just double click on that. Once in here just go to your bin folder and then you should see a file called minecraft. This is an executable jar file. So what you want to do, you want to right click this, click open with and then winrar archiver. So what this is going to do, it's pretty much going to do pretty much what an I, like extracting an ISO does. It shows you all the root files inside that folder or inside that one file itself. So once you're in here, you should, you're going to scroll down and you're going to see in the M area here, it's going to have meta, M-E-T-A, dash I-N-F. What you're going to need to do is you're going to need to right click on it and you're going to, excuse me, you're going to click delete files. Um, so I already have deleted this since I already have done this, so just find your meta, dash I-N-F folder, right click and then click delete files. So once you have that deleted, what you're going to do, you're just going to go ahead and scroll down just a little bit until you get into your class files. Just go ahead and open up the folder that we had extracted the modded class files to. Click Control A to highlight all of these. And you're just going to go ahead and click on one of these and drag all of these files into the archive. So it's going to ask you if you want to uh, actually import this into it. And the update mode should be on Add and Replace. And you click OK. So what this now done is it added all of our modded files into our minecraft.jar. So just go ahead and close that out, close this out, and close this out. So now what you're ready to do is you're ready to start up the game and get to modding. So just go ahead and run the game. I'm going to wait for this to load. First you have to log in, of course. So you guys, um, while I wait for it to uh, load and log in, um, if any of you guys play Minecraft, make sure you hit me up. Uh, I'll be happy to join your servers and play with you guys. I'm actually on Christmas break right now until January 9th off of college, so I will hopefully be uploading a lot here very soon. So uh, as you can see in the bottom left, you should, yeah, I am on version 1.0.0, so just go into single player or whatever you want to do, go to the main world, and play selected world. So just play the world that you want to play. So as you can see, this is my world. This is kind of small. I never really got playing Minecraft extensively. I mean, I love the game. It's a really fun game, but my PC literally sucks. And it's hard for me to actually play games. Like, I have COD 4, but it's kind of difficult to play. I usually get around 30 FPS, which is not bad, but it's not good. So once you're in the game, as you can see, you're just going to click I for your inventory, and you shouldn't see anything here. Um, if you do, of course, you know the modifications are working, but if not, just click the O button, and there you go, we have the mods working. So, uh, just like any other inventory editor, you're just going to scroll over until you find what you want. So, say I want this golden apple. You'll click it, and it'll give, you, give it to you right here in your inventory. Um, some of the new features from the older Too Many Items versions. Um, delete mode, which is one of my favorite features. What you do, you just click that, and it should turn green, which means it's on. And you can just click this, and it automatically deletes it. So, there's no need to drop all of your stuff. Um, of course, rain, you can turn rain on. Creative mode, not really sure what that does. Um, set time to sunrise, set time to noon, set time to sunset, and set time to midnight. These are all really good features to use. So you guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.